Or big time, we got new asphalt. What am I cutting it with? A circular saw. Oh, like a saw? Push down, <laughs> pull trigger. Make sure that you don't touch the blade guard. Oh, I'm gonna try to pull a string line to see how straight this is real quick. I'm making concrete, I'm making concrete. Step one, wake up early, gonna rise in the sun. Step two, get some good, some food in you. Step three, you grow hard about what you wanna be. Step four, fuck everybody just do your thing. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. 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 I have been gone for a week on a French vacation. Merci. Thank you. But I'm excited because today we're heading to the land and we got word that the road has been worked on and that it's getting repaved. So we are heading up there to do some weed whacking to clear some more land. But also we're pretty excited to see how the road has turned out so far after this winter's drama. Yeah, there should be a repaved section a couple hundred feet. So we'll see where it's at. This one. Oh, it's right here. Ooh, this whole section is smooth. Yeah, see, they re you can see where they really did. Where on here. Jeez. Oh, this is a long section. They did a big section. Oh, they did it all the way up through past here. You can see. Oh, I see. They went just past this driveway. Oh, mm, that's a nice little section of road. Yeah. Uh, we're big time, we got new asphalt. That part was pretty rough. It probably doesn't look like much on camera, but <laughs> that little section of road was real bumpy and wobbly and cracked and old, and now it's just smooth. So that's really nice. That It's a pretty long section of road to get fixed for us. That section would be about as long as getting an access road to the property. That's how long our driveway is. Roughly. <laughs> Except ours goes straight up. It's such a beautiful day today that because we live on the way to the beach, the traffic gets wild. So we left right when we got up. We didn't eat. We stopped and grabbed coffee. So we need to reset for a second before we get going. And then we're back to work. I try to use my left hand so I get more muscles on this side. <laughs> Ooh, the tree looks good. Yeah, it's doing pretty good. So we were about to get to work and after we ate breakfast, but Kirk realized he forgot to bring his compressed air blower for working on the lawnmower. So we are headed into town, beachside headed into town, to get a compressed air blower. And I was going to hang the curtains, but I forgot to bring the curtain rod holders. So that's going to have to be for another day because I left those at home too. Turns out when you leave the house in a rush, it sets you back a little bit. 
but that's okay. It's a nice day. We're gonna enjoy it. Forty six. Okay. Forty six. Okay. Mark, what am I cutting it with? The circular saw. Oh, like a saw? Uh, that that saw right there. Nope. That's a drill. It's an impact gun. Wait, this like this? Yeah. I'm gonna do it. Yeah. Don't pull the trigger. Uh, are you sure? You said I. You said, well, you already told me I couldn't use saws. <laughs> what do I? Okay, you're, but you're you're serious. I'm gonna do it. What do I do? We should probably go outside because it's safer. I could cut it in here, but I can. A bit, uh, like beginner, I just learned how to mow a lawn yeah. without the blades going. Let's go outside. Oh my. Kimmy learns how to putt. Okay, am I just doing it on the dirt? No. Dirt. Let's do it over here. But not on the dirt. No. Right here. Just on the helm like just in my hand. <laughs> right here. On here? Do I get to like... It's right there. Do I get to watch a YouTube on this or... Wow, just like that. Just like that. Okay, well, how does this, like, I need a little info. Is it just pull the trigger and just put it on the yeah. thing? Let go of it. So you push this down and pull What's the, that? It's a safety. Okay. Push this down, okay. pull oh. the trigger. Push down, pull the trigger. Make sure that you don't touch the blade guard. What's a blade guard? This here. Oh, I'm not touching that. You just want to line the saw up like that. Okay. And then you're going to pull the trigger and push it through. What is it going to well, do? Do I have to play, hold that button? Well, just play with the saw before you do anything. Okay. Don't let this go. Stand back. Let that go. Okay. 
Okay. Stand back. Don't hold it so close to you. <laughs> okay, okay. You feel it? Mm -hmm. Do I just keep it held? Okay, so you can just hold hold it on there. And you can you can stabilize it for me? I'll hold it for you. Okay. Think you can do it? Yep. Alright. Here, put your sunglasses on. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to look away because I don't want it hit me in the eye. Okay. Those are safety glasses. Safety goggles on. Saw ready. Okay. Okay, are you ready? I'm ready. Do I have to hold the safety down? Yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't want to hurt you. Put the saw down. Okay, on the floor. Right here. Okay. <laughs> I did it! I did it! I did it! Yay! <laughs> I can't wait to tell my parents I used a saw. They're gonna freak out. <laughs> now that I've successfully sawed a curtain rod, I think this is the easy part. Go I got the air conditioning on in the room for you. Good. It's, I'm sweating inside. Oh, that's nice. Okay. Is that, is that long enough? Should be. Measure twice, cut once. Oh, that's perfect fit. Oh, we might have, we probably could have done a little longer. Um, Why? Hmm? The curtain go, doesn't go inside of it. I know, but, oh, I see what you mean. So it does hit these a little bit. I just take them off. Are, is that's not holding in the window frame? No. We could just take them off? Yeah. Oh, nice. With tools? Yeah. Okay, let's put the curtain on. You can't leave her. Jeez. How have you, how have you been doing this? look excited right now. Do I? I am. This is the pinnacle moment I've been waiting for. Well, it is hot. I'm already sweating. We used our morning to run errands and get all the stuff we forgot. And so now by the time we're starting, it is like the heat of the afternoon. So we really set ourselves up for this one. So since our last work on the deck, the markings that we did for square have moved. It looks like it, yeah. Uh, and they're off by about how much right now? A couple inches. Okay. 
Um, so we're going to remeasure these pink strings and try to get it all back into square. That's the plan. We didn't actually write any of the measurements down because last time that we were working on this, Kirk was doing it all in his head. But unfortunately, probably some animals and some weather messed with the measurements a little bit. So we're going to just try to figure that out, get it back into square before we can pour the concrete. So that's what's on the menu right now. Oh, I'm going to try to pull a string line to see how straight this is real quick. That middle one, is it pretty close to the back side? Yeah. Half inch or so? Yeah. I think what happened was the, the strings were pulled tight before and through the weather they got loose. So the 10 foot markings were basically shorter. So now that I've tightened it back up to 10 feet where the marks are fairly close. So it's not, uh, it's not perfect, but this is very, very temporary. So, well, we're within a half inch. So that's, I mean, it's close enough. Yeah. We're a hair out of square. Yeah. <laughs> so now we need to dig out the holes for the pylons. Okay. Do we have shovels? Yeah. My dad didn't dig up any mice with his hands, did he? No. Okay. Okay, I'm pretty sure that's good. Heavy? What? I'm so strong. It's a, it's a little heavy. 
right Follow those lines, we'll make it this time Blurry street lights, work as a guide To memories that we're making tonight Oh yeah, we'll make it tonight Yeah I'll do anything That I feel like I wanna do I'm living life Like I got nothing left to prove No end in sight Just always staying on the move I'll go all night If that's just what I got in time too short To care about what you Wait, so courts. how do you know how many cups are in a court? Because there's 16 ounces is a cup, 32 ounces is a quart, 64 ounces is a gallon. You just hold that info in your brain? You don't need space for other stuff like pop culture? <laughs> so that's one, two and a half. But I think this is a little light, like we have to we were having to add more. More water. Yeah, I recall. That's how you better come out the bottom. I'm making concrete, I'm making concrete. It's like cooking. It's so easy. You did it! Is that all of it? Yep. Okay. All right, so we are done for the day after getting kind of a late start because we had to run all over the place and taking our time to grab some lunch. We finally made it back and we were able to 
water avocado tree, which is looking good. And then we poured some concrete for the pylons for the deck. And we had to remeasure some stuff. I don't know how square it is, but it's close enough <laughs> what we're doing. I think he said it was uh, less than a half inch out of square, so those things got a little messed up, but they're better now. We'll see after the pour. But... All right, so didn't get like miles ahead, but baby steps. It was a super hot day, and we did good. We got one curtain up. And I got one curtain up. <laughs> Man, I will get these curtains up, I promise, but I did get one up next time. Lessons are not always obvious or easy. While learning new skills like mixing concrete or using a saw are inevitable, sometimes unexpected lessons sneak in along the way. There's no way to come out on the other side of this unchanged. Patience, generosity, and a greater appreciation for life all around us pours into us every day. Thanks for joining us. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And join us on Patreon. Oh my gosh, do people who do this wear masks? They should. They don't? Do they just have concrete in their body? Do you poop it out? <laughs>